Source, Fundamental Markets New York, May 31, 2018, Globe Newswire, in new independent research reports released early this morning, Fundamental Markets released its latest key findings for all current investors, traders, and shareholders of Gaming and Leisure Properties, Inc. NASDAQ, GLPI, SmartSand Inc., NASDAQ, SND, Armor Residential Right, Inc., NYSE, ARR, Agon NV, NYSE, AEG, Paratech Pharmaceuticals, Inc., NASDAQ, PRTK, and Clearside Biomedical, Inc. NASDAQ, CLSD, including updated fundamental summaries, consolidated fiscal reporting, and fully qualified certified analyst research. Complimentary access, research reports full copies of recently published reports are available to readers at the links below. GLPI download http colon slash slash fundamental dash markets dot com slash register slash question mark so equals copy SND download http colon slash slash fundamental dash markets dot com slash register slash question mark so equals SND NASDAQ, GLPI, SmartSand Inc., NASDAQ, SND, Armor Residential Right, Inc., NYSE, ARR, Agon NV, NYSE, AEG, Paratech Pharmaceuticals, Inc., NASDAQ, PRTK, and Clearside Biomedical, Inc. NASDAQ, CLSD, on a fundamental level and outlines the overall demand for their products and services in addition to an in-depth review of the business strategy, management discussion, and overall direction going forward. Several excerpts from the recently released reports are available to today's readers below. Important notice, the following excerpts are not designed to be standalone summaries and as such, important information may be missing from these samples. Please download the entire research report, free of charge, to ensure you are reading all relevant material information. All information in this release was accessed May 25, 2018. Percentage calculations are performed after rounding. All amounts in millions, M, except per share amounts. Gaming and Leisure Properties, Inc. GLPI, Report Overview Gaming and Leisure Properties Recent Financial Performance for the three months ended March 31, 2018 versus March 31, 2017, Gaming and Leisure Properties reported revenue of $244.05 and versus $242.71 and up 0.55% and basic earnings per share $0.45 cents versus $0.45, cents, unchanged. For the 12 months ended December 31, 2017 versus December 31, 2016, Gaming and Leisure Properties reported revenue of $971.31 versus $828.26, up 17.27%, and basic earnings per share $1.80 versus $1.62, up 11.11%. .11 Gaming and Leisure Properties is expected to report earnings on July 26, 2018. The report will be for the fiscal period ending June 30, 2018. The reported EPS for the same quarter last year was 78 cents. The estimated EPS forecast for the next fiscal year is $3.14 and is expected to report on February 14, 2019. To read the full Gaming and Leisure Properties, Inc. GLPI report downloaded here. HTTP colon slash slash fundamental dash markets dot com slash register slash question mark so equals gulpy smart sand inc SND report overview smart sand inc's recent financial performance for the three months ended March 31st, 2018 versus March. For the 12 months ended December 31, 2017 versus December 31, 2016, Smart Sand Inc. reported revenue of $137.21 and versus $59.23 and um, up 131.66% and basic earnings per share 54 cents versus 43 cents, up 25.58%. Smart Sand Inc. is expected to report earnings on August 9, 2018. The report will be for the fiscal period ending June 30, 2018. 
the reported EPS for the same quarter last year was six cents. The estimated EPS forecast for the next fiscal year is $1.22 and is expected to report on March 21, 2019. To read the full Smart Standing SND report, download it here, http colon slash slash fundamental dash markets dot com slash register slash question mark so equals SND Armor Residential Right Inc. ARR Report Overview Armor Residential REIT's recent financial performance for the three months ended March 31, 2018 versus March 31, 2017. Armor Residential Right reported revenue of $68.17 and versus $58.58. ,58 for the 12 months ended December 31, 2017 versus December 31, 2016, Armor Residential Right reported revenue of $254.43 and versus $264, um, down 3.62%, and basic earnings per share $4.22 versus $1.67. Armor Residential Right is expected to report earnings on July 25, 2018. The report will be for the fiscal period ending June 30, 2018. The reported EPS for the same quarter last year was 69 cents. The estimated EPS forecast for the next fiscal year is $2.40 and is expected to report on February 13, 2019. To read the full Armor Residential Right, Inc. ARR report downloaded here http colon slash slash fundamental dash markets dot com slash register slash question mark so equals R Agon NV AEG report overview Agon NV's recent financial performance for the three months ended December 31st 2017 versus December th for the 12 months ended December 31st, 2017 versus December 31st, 2016, Agon NV reported revenue of $37,269.38 and versus $37,242.62 and up 0.07% and basic earnings per share $1.01 versus 13 cents up 687.06%. Egon NV is expected to report earnings on May 31, 2018. The report will be for the fiscal period ending March 31, 2018. The reported EPS for the same quarter last year was 17 cents. The estimated EPS forecast for the next fiscal year is 97 cents and is expected to report on February 21, 2019. To read the full Agon NV AEG report, download it here, http colon slash slash fundamental dash markets dot com slash register slash question mark so equals AG P A R A T E K Pharmaceuticals, Inc. PRTK Report Overview Paratech Pharmaceuticals Recent Financial Performance for the three months ended March 31, 2018 versus March 31, 2017. Paratech Pharmaceuticals reported revenue of 1 centim versus 2 centim, down 44.44%, and basic earnings per share 91 cents versus $1.14. For the 12 months ended December 31, 2017 versus December 31, 2016, Paratech Pharmaceuticals reported revenue of $12.62 and versus $0.03, cents em, up 43,403.45%, and basic earnings per share $3.32 versus $5.51. Paratech Pharmaceuticals is expected to report earnings on August 1, 2018. The report will be for the fiscal period ending June 30, 2018. The reported EPS for the same quarter last year was 64 cents. The estimated EPS forecast for the next fiscal year is $3.56 and is expected to report on March 7, 2019. To read the full Paratech Pharmaceuticals, Inc. PRTK report downloaded here http colon slash slash fundamental dash markets dot com slash register slash question mark so equals PRTK CLEARSIDE Biomedical Inc. 
CLSD, Report Overview Clearside Biomedical's recent financial performance for the 12 months ended December 31, 2017 versus December 31, 2016, Clearside Biomedical reported revenue of 35 cents M versus 52 cents M, down 33.65%, and basic earnings per share $2.33 versus $1.97. Clearside Biomedical is expected to report earnings on August 8, 2018. The report will be for the fiscal period ending June 30, 2018. The reported EPS for the same quarter last year was 54 cents. The estimated EPS forecast for the next fiscal year is $2.01 and is expected to report on March 13, 2019. To read the full Clearside Biomedical, Inc. CLSD report downloaded here http colon slash slash fundamental dash markets dot com slash register slash question mark so equal CLSD about fundamental markets fundamental markets serves thousands of members and have provided research through some of the world's leading brokerages for over a decade and continue to be one of the best information sources for investors and investment professionals worldwide. Fundamental Markets roster boasts decades of financial experience and includes top financial writers, FINRA broker check certified professionals with current and valid CRD number designations, as well as chartered financial analyst, CFA designation holders, to ensure up-to-date factual information for active readers on the topics they care about. Registered member status Fundamental markets oversight and audit staff are registered analysts, brokers, and or financial advisors, registered members working within equity research, media, and compliance departments. Fundamental markets roster includes qualified CFA charter holders, licensed securities attorneys, and registered FINRA members holding duly issued CRD numbers. Current license status of several registered members at Fundamental Markets have been independently verified by an outside audit firm, including policy and audit records duly executed by registered members. Complaints, concerns, questions, or inquiries regarding this release should be directed to Fundamental Markets Compliance Department by phone at 1-667-401-0010 or by email at compliance at fundamental-markets.com. Legal notices information contained herein is not an offer or solicitation to buy, hold, or sell any security. Fundamental Markets Fundamental Markets members and or Fundamental Markets affiliates are not responsible for any gains or losses that result from the opinions expressed. Fundamental Markets makes no representations as to the completeness, accuracy, or timeliness of the material provided and all materials are subject to change without notice. Fundamental Markets has not been compensated for the publication of this press release by any of the above-mentioned companies. Fundamental Markets is not a financial advisory firm, investment advisor, or broker-dealer and does not undertake any activities that would require such registration. For our full disclaimer, disclosure, and terms of service please visit our website. Media Contact, Andrew Duffy, Media Department Office, 1-667-401-0010 Email, media at fundamental-markets.com Copyright 2018 Fundamental Markets All rights reserved. For republishing permissions, please contact the Partner Network Manager at partnership at fundamental-markets.com CFA and Chartered Financial Analyst are registered trademarks owned by CFA Institute. FINRA, Broker Check, and CRD are registered trademarks owned by Financial Industry Regulatory Authority, Inc.